What's up guys and welcome to New Tarot. I am the energy and intuitive reader and I'm here to do the love spread for somebody. So let's see who's gonna get it. Gemini. What's up Jen? Thank you so much for being here. Sun, moon, rising, or Venus. I hope you guys are doing well. Some plans could be delayed. Okay. But that's because the universe is setting it up for you. <laughs> okay. All right. Um, I hope you guys are doing well. I'm going to do a love spread, see what's going on between you and your person, and then we're going to clarify, okay? I don't know why I just got this, but if you're dealing with a Libra or have it in your chart, please go watch that reading, okay? All right. Gemini. Let's see. What is a relationship as of now? You have the tower in reverse. There's a... There's a change that needs to happen that is being um, that is not happening, and I feel like both the, both of you guys have some partake in the situation because this is the crowning energy is always both of you. Um, so, yeah, we're gonna clarify. Um, how do you feel? Three of Swords. You're hurt. You're disappointed here. How do they feel? Six of Pentacles in reverse. Like you're not giving enough or as much as they are. What's the obstacle? The Knight of Pentacles in reverse dependency codependency is what i'm getting someone depending too much on someone else um what's the best approach is the eight of wands in reverse allow delays to happen don't try to speed something up what's the potential future the two of swords someone's still being indecisive nothing is changing here bottom of the deck is the seven of wands in reverse someone's gonna stop fighting for this could be an aries leo sag doesn't have to be though all right let's see what is the tower on um, the obstacle could be somebody else as well because there's a person on this card what is the tower in reverse here for um the relationship as of now you have a seven of cups in reverse the page of swords and the king of wands with the strength card could be a leo i feel like you guys are now seeing um Hmm. I feel like you guys are now seeing the attractiveness, the 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 potential. I want to say in this situation, I feel like I feel like both of y'all were holding this off or something like that. Hmm. That. That switched up crazy. But yeah, both of you guys, you're the Seven of Cups in reverse, the King of Wands, and the Page of Swords. You guys are both realizing, and this is all through communication, like you guys speaking to each other, you're realizing that you guys want this more than you thought you did. That's what I'm getting. So maybe you guys are going to allow this change to happen. Because you're both real life. I feel it's going to take a lot of courage from both of you for this to do this. What is this three of swords here for how Gemini feels? Dang. Hold on a second, Gem. Oh, uh, the five of swords, the tower. Oh, <laughs> uh, the tower's upright, though. And the six of cups in reverse. So you're okay with the wheel of fortune. This this was fated to happen, boo boo. So I don't know if you're running or something. Stop, okay. Um, you're stressing out about something that that happened in your past. There's something in your past that you're still linked to, still connected to here, and um, you have to let that go. Point period blank. Like that's just what it is. Um. It's causing you a lot of stress, a lot of anxiety, a lot of pain, a lot of disappointment. You have to let that go, Jen. The, that, you holding on to it. Now, it, now it might not be that you're like physically holding on to it, right? It could be energetically. It could be that you haven't completely put the past person to bed, to sleep, to rest. Um, this doesn't have to be a relationship. This could be like a friendship or a sibling Something in the in your past that happened that was not a good memory to you, you're still holding on to that. And you need to let that go because this relationship is triggering that memory. 
and it's like reminding you like, hey, like you have to let this go. Like you're still, you know, have a lot of stress and anxiety and fear towards this, which you shouldn't at this point because that was at the past. You were supposed to heal that. Okay. Um, let's see. What is the Six of Cups? Whoa. Six of Cups. Yeah, that's that's the past. The past could be like living in your head rent free. Okay, you have to figure out whenever the you know whenever the past comes up in your mind, just tell yourself, I already learned that lesson. I'm going to focus on the present. Tell yourself every time. Every time it pops up, just tell yourself, I already learned that lesson. I already learned that lesson. Right? Because your mind tends to want to go back to what's familiar. And the past is the most familiar. Okay. What is the six of pentacles in reverse here for Gemini's person's feelings? Ace of Pentacles, the Two of Wands in reverse, and the Knight of Pentacles with the Five of Wands in reverse. Your person is so cute, bro. This person just wants to keep the peace. This person just wants to keep the peace here. They're no, they know that there's delays here, but this person, they have an offer for you, Gemini. But they're taking their sweet ass time giving it to you here because again, they feel like you're not giving, you're not giving them how, you know, equal give and take energy. And there's st they still have this offer for you here. Like they they still have it. It's still here. I feel like um, I feel like they're they they're, they're getting advice from their friends and their family here that is not um, is not the best advice because I feel like they're they're also opening up to these people and telling them like, hey, you know, this is. They're telling them how they truly see it, but how they truly see it is not really what it is because you're only holding back because you're still in pain. It's not like you're trying to be malicious towards this person, you know, and I don't feel like this person is telling their peoples that like, oh, Gemini is just hurting. Even even if your person knows that, you know, they're not saying that. So it's like they're people's things that you could be trying to, you know, get one up on this person because of that. But that's not the case. And this person knows that, which is why they're not going nowhere, which is why they still have this offer for you. And they're still hold like they still got it. Like this is this is a loyal ass person right here, bruh. Okay. Um, what is this nine of pentacles in reverse here for the obstacles and challenges? Um, obstacles and blocks. I mean, same thing. <laughs> Seven of Swords, the King of Wands, and the Hermit in reverse with the Strength card here. It could be a Leo. So the obstacle here is um, codependency here. It's like, I feel like one of you two could portray a certain image real hard. You know what I'm saying? But when it comes down to it, it's like, I don't want to say they that they can't back it up. I don't want to say that because I feel like they can. It's more like you can see right through them. You can see right through this facade. You can see and and it's like the the challenge is somebody being openly with it. Like, you know, yeah, like not that not that needing people you don't even know how to want to say it, but it's like somebody needs to be open to you know, sharing and, you know, depending on someone that can, you know, provide, if that makes sense. And, and, and it's not in a codependency type of energy, but somebody's trying to play it off like, oh, nah, like, I don't need nobody. Like, I'll be good about myself, blah, 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 blah. Yeah. So then why are you even entertaining any of this? You know what I'm saying? Like, it's like, there's 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 something there and i don't even want to whoever it is that's doing this it's not it's like this person has been used to doing things on their own forever <laughs> you know this person is very independent and um they're used to having their own things and taking care of their own stuff that inviting another energy to like help them out or to like co-create is a different language to them so you know i don't feel like it's being done purposely um, but I do feel like it's coming off that way. Like I do. <sighs> yeah. The strength card here. I feel like this person, yeah, it's, it's it, whoever it is, it could be you or your person, right? But it's it, this resistance. It's, it's very much, um, 
but I feel like that's gonna get dropped. Like, like I feel like they're gonna take it down some notches, or this relationship is making them realize that. Take down how that resonates. What is this Eight of Wands in reverse here for the best approach? The Knight of Cups, the Knight of Wands, and the Queen of Cups in reverse with the Sun in reverse. Um, the best approach is to allow delays to happen here because I feel like an offer is is still on the table. Like I feel like this offer is going to come in a lot quicker and a lot faster if the delays are just like, like just allowed you know like don't overstress don't overthink like if, you, if things are going left just allow them to go left and ride the wave you know what i'm saying um i feel like it's not gonna feel too good but i feel like it's needed because it's like it's kind of like whoever is the one that's making the offer has to come into agreement with their emotions and their actions it's like they both have to be Copacetic. They both have to be on the same level in order for this offer to be made. And it might not be that it's, it can't happen right now or, you know, things are kind of behind. Um, but it's like all of that is happening on purpose. Like everything, it, the timing is um, impeccable. Okay. What is this to a sword here for the potential future? The Death card, the Two of Pentacles, and the Ten of Pentacles with the Moon in reverse. Could be a Cancer or a Scorpio. Um, I feel like there, the potential is someone still not making a decision on a family or an abundant situation here. Still weighing out the options here because there is an ending that has to happen. Um, and until that ending happens, I don't feel like a decision is going to be made. But once that ending does happen, it will. Yep, four of wands, eight of wands in reverse, and the moon in reverse. Yep, the delays will be over and the celebration could start. But it's like this this death card here is a harsh ending. Like it's a very much transformational, change your life forever type of thing. So, yeah. All right, Gemini, that's all that I have for you. I hope this helped. Have a good day or a good night whenever you watch this and stay positive.